of you who are ministers listening to me, you must make every effort to fill your congregation with the knowledge of Christ. The more of Christ a Christian knows, the more he can fulfill what God has given to him or he can operate what God has given to him for life and what God has given to him for godliness. Old Testament is good for people to see how God related with men in the past. But the doctrine that the New Testament church is based upon is the doctrine of Christ himself, not the Old Testament doctrine. Therefore, when you read the Old Testament and you read the, the life of people like Elijah, Elisha, Moses, and all the miracles they did, that is just for you and I to learn that if these men walk with God without the Holy Spirit inside them, Holy Spirit did not live in them. It comes upon them and it goes. But if these men, David and the rest of them, Solomon, can walk with God and some of them can perform so much signs and wonders by faith in God, that means that anyone born again can do everything they did and we can go beyond. That's why Jesus said, among all men born by women, none of them is as high as John the Baptist. Jesus told us that John the Baptist is the highest prophet, higher than Elijah, higher than Moses, higher than every prophet who ever lived before him. But he said, Jesus said, the least in the kingdom of God is even higher than John the Baptist. Come on now. Somebody who got born again right now is higher than John the Baptist. Jesus said that. In another words, somebody who is born again right now is higher than Moses, Elijah, Elisha, name them. And Jesus never gets his words wrong. He is the word himself, incarnate. That's the reason why the Bible said further in Peter, why he was writing to us.